Alrighty then everybody, welcome back to another video. For today's video, we're going to be playing more kingdoms and castles. So, um, we're back here in our little way empire here, and we're going to, uh, continue dealing with the, uh, money problem. Because apparently money is too low for these people here. So we might need to raise taxation, which is going to make the peasants a little less happy, obviously, it means that they're... Taking money out of their pockets at a fast rate here, and it does appear that we have a, a diplomat. We have a message from her. I have a secret to share with you, sure, but too much promise to tell anyone. Uh, sure. So, since you got the castle just as a commoner, yup. There was the taverns for a drink, nice. I must have meant to tell about amongst the peasants. <laughs> it does sound fairly. I just really like this, yup. This message from our ruler, I guess. Peace out. Uh, now she starts telling us about how she, like, um, isn't the greatest of, uh, rulers. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> um, how is the food pro- the Guys, can we maybe do a little bit better? On Food. Be nice. Let's go ahead and put that there, and then go ahead and put a ton more farms. I just want all the farms <laughs> over here. Uh, and that's gonna be already another granary, and I believe granaries are two spaces, so we should be able to put another granary right about here. Um, obviously, we need a ton of granaries because obviously we have a whole. Uh, wheat currently. Uh, apparently even raising the taxation up this high isn't getting the job done. Um, this ain't good. Can y'all... Okay. We just see more people. Not a lot of people are deciding it's worthy to stay in this area here. But nope. How many more builders do we have? None. So it should mean that this job, that job's not going back then. Uh oh. Let's go ahead and lower this and then. But I need the food though. Oh, there we go. Perfect. So then we can go ahead and raise it up by. I know, mean, so we. Are gonna want that there so then the granaries are being worked by some people um, so we can continue getting the food from the granaries all right so we actually are almost out of space again so the houses are gonna go this way so that's no space for another cottage or two and same on this other side here all right, what do the advisors have to say? Nothing. Perfect. Usually you only have nothing to say, that usually means that they're pretty happy with um, ruling over the peasants. Requires charcoal. We don't have any charcoal because it had stopped. Adoption, that's not good. Perfect. So now hopefully it gets a little bit... More, a little bit more staff there. And obviously we're about to ruin this again. But I need more homes, damn it. Okay. How much did that have to go away? A lot. I want at least... I want a bunch of them working on the charcoal. Because I, I need charcoal a lot to produce more tools and then produce more fish. Um, we might also need another fishing area. We might be able to build one over here. That's in the... Um, in and of itself. I might be able to get one over here though. That could work. Obviously, we are gonna need a lot more food. Uh, I think we might open up the orchard, uh, the orchards again. And we'll cut down on. Wow. Something just happened outside, I'm not sure what that was there, but something big. 
just happens. Oh, we're actually full now. Well, that's good. Um, peasants are relatively sad. <laughs> Uh, but we do have a nice amount of gold, and food is getting back up on track, uh, which is obviously very good. Um, that cart is going to be finished. We have one idle person. There we go, let's have... Um, but, uh, whoa, let's, uh, let's, uh, have our, our areas, our, um, areas, our stockpiles that have more workers. Uh, okay, so this one is zero of this, this is gonna go down to 100, by 50, let's go down to 20, 20, let's go up to 590, let's go down, 70, 600, <laughs> uh, there we go, um, that should hopefully hold us over a bit, apparently we're really struggling to get more charcoal, uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and build up a, um, charcoal maker, so we can get more, obviously, charcoal Produces are basically at the very bottom here. Now there's six. The peasants have been ever decreasing in happiness. <laughs> oh, they're going back up. Good. I do not like it when uh, y'all are sad, and I do not like it when my voice cracks because it's annoying. It's storing too much wood in that place. Wow. Wood is apparently a very easy resource to produce. We're actually running out of areas to store wood. Alright, none decided how many people. Um, but nobody found it fit this day. What do you mean? What's not fit about this place that is beautiful? Alright, so let's go ahead and put down another, um, big storage unit here. I think we'll put it right across from the, uh, other one that we have here. So we're going to go ahead and chop down those trees there. But then, uh, go to put down another one. Another one. Chop down the trees a little faster, please, before more grow. <laughs> and then, all of a sudden, can't put that there. There we go. Okay, how is this affecting jobs? Wow, only one of them has people working in it, and it only has one person working, which is only like about a third of what they need. That ain't good. The fish is actually, like, we don't have any fish. Um, maybe... Where'd be the best spot to go for more fish? Would it be to come in? No, it's probably- I think over here is best- is the best spot. We can go in and build a road that comes down like this, but- Actually, we did just finish this. Alright, so instead of boring you guys with me figuring out what the numbers are, I'll be back once I figure out what the numbers are. Alright, so I just figured out the numbers for uh, this one there. Um... I want to make sure that we have basically the exact numbers that uh, I want in those places. Alright, so let's go ahead here and really, do people keep on coming? Yeah, no one saw fit to stay. Hmm. Why? We, do we produce more food than we, I don't think we produce any food. barely produce anything. I think it's like, what, 500, 600? If I was gonna delete that, then we would have no food left. Or no food, no storage left. For food. You know what? How full is this? 
It is actually relatively full. So we go ahead and destroy it. But then we go ahead and grab one of the big granaries so we make sure they really build this because they better be going to that. Alright, what do you have? What do you want? Need some resources. We'd like to build an archer school. Um you want it, but I can't, um, I can't help them because I don't have anything to help them with. So, oh, I can only store 50, that's strange. Okay, how is, how is the berries doing? The berries are not looking good. Uh, should probably extend the road. Go ahead and extend the road. Like that. We should probably just put produce storage all along the walkway there. See what we really want to focus on is um we could actually have these two meet up if we wanted to. What jobs are being no one. Okay that's good. There we go. Now we have uh, four hundred and fifty storage here. <clears throat> We should really get some more farms up and running. Should we do another one here? Yeah, we'll go ahead and put another section connecting all of this. Right there. And then go ahead and put down some more farms here. So someone drowned. What? Um, am I okay? Someone drowned, unfortunately. Do I have an access? No, I have a not not enough workers, actually. Uh, I'd like to man all these places, but I can't. Apparently, we don't have. Anyway, it takes three. Do we have four out of six? Yeah, no one is fun of the job. There we go. There, so now that thing should start producing more charcoal. We really need more charcoal. Because it makes the peasants happy. Their homes. It makes, their, makes their homes happy. There we go. 71. That's nice. You like to see that. Now let's go ahead and see how much grain we produce. Here, it should be more than enough for... A burgeoning town like us here. Yeah, about 300. We have no fish, and we are making more, um, more produce, which is obviously a very good. Um, so right, we wanted to come out here with a massive road that led straight to the ocean. How does that affect this? It completely. Gets rid of struggle. You see, if you all just make the roads real quick, I'm sure we won't have that problem. And we don't. Perfect. Does that mean we actually have one extra? We do. I shall go ahead and drop that down, because then we're gonna build a house! Now I have to be careful on uh, this side, especially. Uh, I think we might be able to put a road here that kind of links it all together with some houses and some produce, but this is a nice, uh, fertile patch of land that we will be able to use, um, for farming purposes, for producing, uh, like, fruits and everything like that, and that's what we mainly are gonna want. Okay, the personalities fully stand. None of those are fully stacked. Where is it? Are they the... Oh, they're the marketeers. There you go. Yeah, not, they're the marketeers. I didn't realize that they were marketeers. Uh, we have four builders. Which is not the building, then, yeah, we would have full stuff. So I think what we're really going to want to try and... Uh, we'll link these two up and then continue this way. Um... I think the next house might go over here. We, really, we need a lot more people. Obviously to continue growing and more people to grow. Yeah, for 20. 
618. Wood is really uh, being produced at an excessive rate. And it does take up a nice, a fair bit of jobs here. So we're going to go and lower it down to 8. And then put those 4 that we just took away into the stockpile business. And we'll go ahead and just close one of these places down entirely. That might have been easier. And they decided they were <laughs> going to land over there. And they... Okay, the AI pathfinding is weird. Uh, but they're here now. What would you like? Nothing. Yeah, I know. Fog is my favorite. It's a favorite of your people. Uh. Of course. Oh, I chose, uh, the wrong one. Uh. Bread. <laughs> bread. Bread is, yep, bread, it's bread. I like, we like bread. I, we, we like bread. Bread's, uh, very good for you, you know. Spread. Sp let's actually lower that down to six there. And while we have all these extra people, let's go ahead and get, ah, no, Vikings, gosh darn it. Oh, at least we have all these towers, though. Okay, not all these towers, we have two. Um, go ahead and build up some towers. Uh, pause suggestion on the residential area. Get those towers built. Because... Is there a dragon and raiders? What the frick? There's dragons and... Vikings. That's stupid. We should just... Yeah, we just, uh... Killed him there. How are the, uh... ones doing? Not bad, we need to build another one of those there. Go ahead and continue building that house. So then we can get some more peeps in our kingdom. Uh, we're thinking that we're gonna need more food storage. And eh, we might. Yeah, we'll extend the roads out this way and we'll put it like right there. Okay, so the roads are gonna extend out. Okay, well this is not fertile. So if we went ahead and... Um, up more up north. Is more fertile land. So what we're gonna do here is we're just gonna go ahead and put in well not put in, so um I don't think that we need that I don't think we need any of these just yet. We'll have to we'll, we'll work that out at some time. But we do need another granary. And so the roads come down like this. We can't put the roads in, so it's going to put the roads in. The roads come down like that, and then we can have another road here. Kind of connect stuff like that. Then we can put the granary like here or here. Five more storage. Okay, so let's go ahead and get getting some idle workers, which is... Obviously relatively good. Oh, one of the houses caught on fire. How is water on this? Yeah, it's not great. Why don't we go ahead and put another well out here? In the space for a tavern. I'm gonna put a well right there. And then let's go ahead and put down a tavern. Can we get a mason? Yes. Let's get a mason. And so the mason will go right here. Right here is a good spot. So we're gonna put the mason down right there, so you can go ahead and fix up some of these buildings that are still damaged. Or I think specifically just this building was damaged. And that one a little bit. This wall over here. Anything else? Nah, no, don't look like it. 
Uh, too crowded. Oh, we do not have. I don't think we have a single hospital slash clinic. Which probably is not the greatest thing. We're gonna put the clinic outside. We'll go ahead and put it right here, right down the road. I can't, I don't remember which way is the door. I'm assuming that way. No, I did not mean to pause it there. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, stop recording while this builds, and I'll be back once it's done recording, uh, once it's done building. Alright, so the clinic is basically just about done. And every time I'm recording is because they sent us a little diplomat here, so I just wanted to see what they had to say, and I wanted to catch it on camera. We want to trade. Let's see how many docks. Go to dock with two, and then we can still trade out with each other. Alright. Well, we are going to need docks. This might be the next thing. Okay, so docks. So I did go ahead here, and we got ourselves... Um... Did get ourselves... Uh, of a clinic, and we are actually we are currently repairing something. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and see. Oh, did they repair that? Yeah, they repaired it. Anyways. What's uh, what's so damaged? Birds telling us that the peasants are happy. Y'all, our bonings are at 100%. Uh, we're actually getting really close to our storage limits, which is fine. That's why I built these extra roads here to so put in a massive granary. We still have two idle, wow. Very nice. Uh, and we can probably also go in and put in some more produce storage. Here, I'm going to say just one for now. Send it to why? Why? Oh yeah, we're we're going way overboard here, and no one could build this quick enough to where it would be done in time. All right, well, uh, something to repair at this point in time. So we'll go ahead and get the extra workers, so we can try and get this thing built extra quickly. Um. How's wood? 30, so it's literally at the max. Everywhere, basically. We'll go ahead and close down another one of these uh, wood stations. Tender workers, yeah. We'll go ahead and close it so that then uh, only one of them is current is uh, operating. Um, what we could do is more charcoal. Uh, and since we have seven idle workers, we'll go ahead and put this up to ten. And we'll still have three after that. Uh, so I'll go ahead and grab our sails. Some more roads. Okay, now we have more uh, storage, so then we can hold all this food. We're producing a lot of food. Um, so we are going to lower this down to 23, and leave ourselves with a ton of, uh, people who aren't working. Uh, you know what we should do? We should definitely get a dock. We're using a good spot for a dock. I never got this extra fishing area. Fish hut? Do it. Uh, and then... I'm just going to put the, uh, fishing hut there. And then we're also going to want a fishmonger on this side. Uh, actually on this side because... It won't be taking up any fertile lands. Yeah, okay, so now we got, those people got some more stuff they can do. We're going to try and start toning down the number of uh, farmers. Uh, but unfortunately, that is going to be all the time that we have for today's video. I hope y'all enjoyed. If you guys did, uh, keep on doing this. Y'all know what to do. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.